three were created. Man, made of clay. Angels, made of light. And a third, made of fire. Because he suffers from panic attacks, he's been signed off work in the past and put on antidepressants. When I'm working, I'm normally fine. It doesn't really affect me. Uh, if maybe the day before, the night before, I do feel that it's getting a little bit heavy, I wouldn't normally come in. He claims medication hasn't worked for him. Instead, he says he's possessed by a djinn, a supernatural being. <laughs> You are burning. You are burning. Who's burning you? Who's burning you? It's not me. I am reading. Who's burning you? Who's burning you? Who's burning you? What I am reading? What I am reading? You don't believe in what I am reading? Eh? What is what is your religion? Treating him is Abu Muhammad an exorcist who operates from the back room of his home in Ilford. Here, he's summoning the jinn inside of Madassa. Did he come to you? And speaks to it directly. Is it you who cause him panic attack? Is it you who sent him to hospital? What you did? Abu Muhammad is well known. He has a waiting list months long and charges 60 pounds a session for his services. He claims to remove evil spirits from people who believe they're possessed by reading passages from the Quran. The exorcist knows what he does is somewhat controversial. While we're filming, he's constantly filming us, concerned we're going to distort what he's doing here. The body feels battered. That's what it feels like. Even now I feel a bit drowsy, <laughs> but it's just like if it's like slowly wearing off, mm. you know, all that reading. And you think you'll feel better now for having uh, come here, for the, yeah, also for the rest of the week, or? It, it, it will give me like it will give me a boost. It would like, you know, it's like a dose of medicine, isn't it? There is a magic in this body. Madassa's views are not Where uncommon. Among British what Asians in the, the UK, the belief in what evil spirits is widespread. Who that can be concepts food? like black magic. At its more extreme, it's that the body can be possessed, causing physical harm. The concept of jinn is in the Quran. What do you want? How old are you? <laughs> How old? Ten! How old? Ten! Ten! Thousand! Oh. What's your name? Oh. What's your name?
How many jinn is under this body? Yalla bi ibn Allah. How many? Three. All kafir? Yes, all kafir. So you don't have a religion. Who's, who created you? Allah. Al Hay, Al Samir, Al Hakim, Del Jalali, Al Akram, Allah, Khalaq Al Insan, Al Mantin, Khalaq Al Jan, Al Nar, Al Samum, La Ilaha Illa Hu, Wahdahu La Sharika Lahu, Wa Ilayhi Turjaun. You need this body, yes or no? Yalla? Bismillah, 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 Allah. Look at you shaking like a dog, huh? Look at you shaking like a dog, huh? You need this body, yes or no? Yes. Yes? Where did you enter from? Yeah. Where did you enter from? Where did you enter from? Stop my god! Stop my god! Huh? Stop my god! Where did you enter from? Stop my god! Stop my You're lying. Stop my god! You are lying. Where did you enter from? Yalla, Bismillah. Ed! 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 No, you are lying. Ed! Ed! Lying! Ed! What's the reason for you being here? It was religion. Huh? It was religion. And you, you don't want religion? No. You're a kafir? Yes. Huh? You're a kafir, huh? Kafir. Who created you, Mr. Kafir? Who created you? God, God, God. God created, God created God, you. God, 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 God. from his left arm. From his left arm. I'm talking to you by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. By Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala power. I am talking to you by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala power. Azza wa jal. Only Allah azza wa jal. With his power and his knowledge, yeah? What you want? Yeah, you what you want. You're creation of Allah. I've got a question for you. Who created you? God. God created you. You believe in God? No. Huh? Oh, you just told me that God created you now. I'm huh? a liar. You're a liar. I noticed that you're a liar. What do you want from this man? Why you are inside of his body? I don't want nothing from him. Let me go. Uh, I said, answer very nicely. By the way, of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, inshallah ta'ala. You are possessing this man inside of him. What do you want from this man? I Why are you pressing him? I want to kill him. You want to kill him? Yeah. Do you know that life belongs only to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala azza wa jal. He kills and he takes life and he gives lives. Yeah. And do you know that you as well, you're going to die jinn inside of this body? Do you know that you one day, you're going to die as well and only Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala azza wa jal who will live forever and ever and ever. He's the ever even hayy al qayyum. Do you know that every creation will die? Who are you to take his life? Huh? Who are you to take his life? Who are you to take his life? Huh? No. Do you have a religion? No. Do you have a religion? No. Do you not believe in the Almighty Allah who created you? No. Think for yourself, Ayyuha Jinni. Think for yourself, Ayyuha Jinni. Who created you, Ayyuha Jinni? Allah Azza wa Jal. He created you from the smoke of the fire, Ayyuha Jinni. Allah Azza wa Jal created you from the smoke of the fire, Ayyuha Jinni. Yes. Huh? Yes, 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 yes. It's not fair what you do unto him. Ayyu al I give you two options. Uh, you believe in God, the Almighty, Azza wa Jal, and the last day of judgment? Oh, yeah, huh? yeah, and you enter paradise, the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, the final messenger. You stay inside of this body, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will burn you in the day of judgment. If you die as a disbeliever, as Allah said in the Quran, إِنَّ الَّذِينَ كَفَرُوا وَمَاتُوا وَهُمْ كُفَارًا أُولَٰئِكَ عَلَيْهِمْ لَعْنَةُ اللَّهِ لَعْنَةُ اللَّهِ وَالْمَلَائِكَةِ وَالنَّاسِ يَجْمَعِينَ خالدين فيها لا يخفف عنهم العذاب ولا هم ينظرون. You die as a disbeliever, you go to hell fire in the side of this body. Do you understand? Yes. Do you understand? Yes. Yalla bismillah, the choice is yours. You die, you come out of this body as a believer, as a Muslim, or as a disbeliever? No, no, Allah help you subhanahu wa ta'ala. I'm not here to help you. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help you. God the Almighty Azza wa Jal, who give me the power by read the Quran al Karim for you to react like this. If you repeat after me the kalima of La ilaha illallah, Muhammad al-Rasulullah, you become a Muslim and Allah will forgive your sin for being inside of this body. I'm a Muslim. You're a Muslim? Yes. Yalla, repeat after me then. Ashadu. Ashadu. Allah. Allah. Ilaha. Ilaha. Illallah. Illallah. Wa ashadu. Wa ashadu. أن محمدا رسول الله جنسات ذي سبودي
You have testified there is no one worth of being worshipped by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and Muhammad is the final messenger. If you are lying, thus between you and God subhanahu wa ta'ala azza wa jal. If you are truthful, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept you and make you enter Jannah inside of this body. Which body part did you enter from? I entered first of all. Bismillah, you're gonna leave now.